Hi everyone, I'm back. A little surprise, I'm going to take it in baby steps. Today I'm going to make a very simple, quick recipe, sauteed mushrooms. I love them. Uh, the only one that likes them in the house beside me is my daughter-in-law. Uh, I can eat the whole thing and I do eat the whole thing. <laughs> Uh, and they do shrink, so I cheated today. I bought them sliced. Usually I buy them whole, I wipe them down, and then I slice them. But I have to do these things quickly. I'm still doing my therapy. But somebody said on uh, one of my uh, posts, on one of my uh, videos, you don't have to do a recipe or make a big deal. We just want to talk to you. We want to see you. Well, so I decided to do my mushrooms. I have this uh, pan heating up and I have about a half a cup of olive oil. I like it oily. Then I have four garlic cloves. You don't have to use as much garlic if you don't want to. And I have parsley here. I would like a little bit more parsley, but I'm limited on my parsley. I thought I had some in the fridge, but this is enough. And I got a teaspoon of hot pepper. So what I'm gonna do here while the oil is heating up is I'm gonna slice the garlic. Now, I don't know if anybody out there likes it, but I like to eat the garlic, especially when it crisps up. It's delicious. And it doesn't make your breath stink, like some people say. Especially when it's cooked, it doesn't uh, do that. Anyway, so this garlic is, look, heating up and you saute it. You throw in the parsley. Woo, it's popping. It shouldn't be popping. There's no water in it. But hey. And yet it is. Yet it is. <laughs> you could put less hot pepper or more hot pepper to your taste. And when the garlic starts to get a little brown around the edges. We'll put the mushrooms in. I should put this here so it doesn't pop all over my stove. Too late. Too late. <laughs> Did you miss me? I want to ask you a question. I'm trying to let my hair grow out. I'm getting tired of, of dyeing my hair. I had it for so many years, red, Auburn. Now it's like four or five inches out and it kind of looks blondish. This is the old color which is very oxidized. And uh, there we go. And I just wanted to get your opinion. My daughter doesn't like it. She thinks it makes me look older. My granddaughter Isabella said, Nanny, dye your hair. <laughs> She's a real pisser, that kid. And then I have other people that say, it looks great. It looks great. Well, I don't know. I haven't formed a real opinion yet. So give me some feedback. Do you think it makes me look older? Should I go blonde? Should I go back to my auburn hair? I don't know. Let me know. I gotta get some salt. I missed a little piece of parsley. Put a, a, about a teaspoon of salt or less. To, everything's to your liking. I'm a firm believer. You do it to your own taste. You can always add, you can't take it out. And these, like I said, these 
go down. They shrink. Look at that. And oh, look at my little piece of garlic there. That's what I like. Everybody thinks I'm crazy, but it's delicious. So I'm gonna let this cook for about, I don't know, five to 10 minutes when you see everything starting to go down. And I'll be back. My little sippy poo. I haven't, you know, I'm doing my exercises. I got to do my therapy. Uh, it's been February 1st I had uh, the surgery. So how many weeks is that? Today's April. It's almost three months. Today's the 24th or the 23rd? 24th. Ah, Alexandria is 11 months today. Yes, she My is. little granddaughter. She's going to be a year next month. Boy, does time fly. Well, I'll be back when the mushrooms are done. Okay, so it's been five minutes. The mushrooms are done. I'm going to enjoy them tonight. I'm the only one that's going to be eating them, and I eat the whole thing. As I said, I'm going to be doing shorter videos because I can't stand too long. So for the next few weeks, I'll do shorter videos, but then I'll be back doing my regular stuff. I have a few ideas of what to do, and uh, we'll do them a little at a time. Okay, hope you're happy to see me and let me know how you like my hair. Also, don't forget to subscribe and share, share my videos, share them with your friends, share them with your family. Share them with Nanny. strangers, yeah. Share them with anyone. So it's Nanny's Italian Kitchen. See you next time.